Atopic eczema. Treatment options for adults, including biologic therapies. What is eczema? Atopic eczema affects around 1 in 5 children and 1 in 10 adults in the UK. Atopic eczema, also known as atopic dermatitis or eczema, is the most common form of eczema and is a chronic, dry, itchy, inflammatory skin condition. Eczema can affect any area of the body in adulthood, often affecting the areas of the skin that bend or crease, for example, wrists, inside elbows, and behind knees. It can also affect the face, hands, feet, and genital areas in adults. Avoiding your trigger irritants and allergens, along with an agreed management and treatment plan, and a good skincare regime, are the best approach to eczema management. Skin without eczema. In skin where there is no eczema or dry skin, the surface of the skin, also called the skin barrier, is intact. This means that there are no breaks in the skin. This acts as a barrier to prevent bacteria, allergens or irritants getting through the skin layer. The cells of the skin bind together like a well-cemented brick wall with no gaps and there is no excess loss of moisture from the skin. The skin barrier is also protected or lubricated by natural oils in the skin. Skin with eczema. In skin with eczema, the skin is dry and the skin barrier is weakened or broken. The corneocytes, the building blocks of the skin, are in a regular shape and therefore do not bind together very well, like an old brick wall with gaps. This means moisture can escape and bacteria, allergens and irritants can travel deeper into the skin layers, causing inflammation and itch. The skin producing less natural oil can also contribute to the development of eczema, causing dry and itchy skin and a genetic mutation or fault on the filigrin gene. Immune response. In atopic eczema, there is an immune response where the body creates a reaction to a usually harmless substance such as pollen or animal saliva or fur. These irritants and allergens enter the body through the broken skin they make contact with cells in the immune system and these cells mistake the irritants and allergens for harmful invaders such as bacteria. This causes the immune cells to overreact and mount an attack. The immune cells in the blood then produce lots of chemicals including cytokines and histamines to attack the irritant or allergen. This immune response is designed to prevent it causing harm to the body. However, in protecting itself, the immune system causes an inflammatory reaction, which in eczema results in the familiar redness, swelling, itch and rash. Response timing. Although this immune response can sometimes happen quickly within minutes, often in eczema, it can take hours or even days to appear on the skin. This is why it can be so difficult to detect triggers that worsen your eczema. Chronic or long-standing eczema can be very difficult to treat. The overreaction in the immune system isn't switched off and the immune system keeps on producing chemical messengers to try to protect itself even long after triggers and allergens have been removed from the environment. This can lead to temporary skin changes, such as thickening of the skin, called lichenification, and patches of the skin darkening or lightening, called inflammatory pigmentation. Here, we will look into biologic therapies in the treatment of adult atopic eczema. Biologic therapies work by blocking or preventing the chemical mediators in the immune system from being able to produce an allergic response and cause inflammation. It does this by targeting specific chemical mediators or messengers called cytokines. Cytokines help to regulate the immune system. 
cytokines produce a group of chemical messengers called interleukins, IL. Interleukins are useful in helping the body fight bacteria and viruses. But in allergic disease, they can overproduce and cause the inflammation that leads to chronic eczema. There are currently two types of biologic therapies that are showing promising results in the treatment of atopic eczema. These are Biologic Therapy Monoclonal Antibodies, MABs, and JAK inhibitors. A limited number of biologic therapies are currently available for the treatment of eczema. However, a range of these types of medications, including those administered by injection, tablets and topical creams, are currently in a research trial stage and are going through rigorous clinical testing for use for eczema patients to see if they are safe and can improve or control symptoms. The future. Scientific research into eczema and new drug therapies show promising signs of the treatment of eczema for the future. These new therapies are showing really good indications in clinical trials that they can provide effective symptom relief, significantly improving quality of life and overall reduce the impact that living with eczema has on yourself and your family. For more information on our services, visit www.allergyuk.org or call our helpline on 01322 619 898. The production of this video has been made possible by Eli Lilly and Sanofi.